Hey y'all, welcome back to Life With Me. So I'm back with another video. And y'all, I'm coming back with my makeup baskets. Or as I want to call it, makeup at a glance. I'm calling it makeup at a glance because this is makeup. I'm trying to go through all my makeup, the ones I have not used in a while, and make sure everything gets used, you know what I'm saying? And I got this great idea of using this organizer from Cute Little Nurse here on YouTube. Because, you know, I like to be organized with my makeup. And she did a makeup basket. And I saw this cute little container or box or makeup carrier or makeup organizer. And I said, yes, that will be perfect. So, all of this is my makeup that I have to choose from for next week. I'm going to go ahead and run through them real quick. So, you see what I am going to be working with. Okay? So, let's go ahead and get started. We're going to start in the front, mine as well, with eyeshadows. Now, these are eyeshadows I have not used or I've had for a while. The first one is the Too Faced Peanut Butter and Jelly. I will be using this. Mmm, doesn't really smell it. Well, I kind of smell peanut butter a little bit. I'll be using this this week. My uh, Anastasia Beverly Hills Norvina palette. I have this and have not used it yet. So it's beautiful purple, so I'll be using this. Going back in, I have my first palette by Juvia's Place. This is the Nubian one. So I'll be using this. It's been through some things. It's been dropped a few times, but yeah, I'll be using this. I'll also be using my Huda Beauty Texture Shadows, the Rose Gold Edition. I don't know the last time. I even looked at this. Oops. But here, this is her first one. You know, she reformulated them. But this is that eyeshadow palette. So I'll be using this. All right. Sorry, y'all. I know my uh, battery is running low, so I have to change it. Okay. And the last eyeshadow is going to be this ColourPop Double Entendre. This is a nice neutral palette. So I have this as well. All right, face sprays. My face has been dry this spring and summer. I've been very dry. So, face sprays I'm going to be using are this Clinique Moisture Surge Face Spray for Thirsty Skin Relief. My uh, Pixie Glow Mist. One's almost done, so I have another one. So, I'll be using that. And to set it, I'll be using... My Sephora Beauty Amplifier and the Anastasia Dewy Set. So those are the setting sprays I'm going to be using. All right, let's move over here to powders. This first one is the Hourglass. I have not reached for this in forever. So I'll be using this Hourglass to set my under eye. Also, to set my under eye, I'll be using this Cover FX uh, Press Powder. And this is in the color Candlelight, so I'll be using this. And I will also be using this Derm Blend Loose Setting Powder in Warm Saffron for under my eyes. Oops, spilling it in there. So I'll be using that. And for setting my face, I'll be using this Laura Mercier. Candle Glow Sheer Perfecting Powder. And that's what that looks like. And for some extra glow, this won't be setting anything, but I'll be using the Lancome Absolute Powder in the color Golden. This is really a highlight. So what it looks like but it's really it's highlighting so I won't be setting anything I'll just be using this to help me do a little highlighting so that's what that is for okay now that since we're talking about highlighters let's go on into my highlighters I'm going to be using using first I'm going to be using this Becca champagne pop that's what that one looks like man that's Bad swatch. That's Champagne Pop. And I'm also going to be using Becca Topaz. That's Topaz. Y'all saw me. 
I'm not dressed for the video, okay? And that's Topaz right there. And the last one I'm going to be using is the can uh, Cover FX Candlelight. And that's what that one looks like. Swatch you right here. See, they're all different tones. Light, medium, dark. Very nice. Okay. All right, moving on to blushes. See how great this is? Look how organized this is. I have not used my MAC blushes in forever. So we're gonna be using MAC this, this week. First one is Raisin. They're just so dry. They're so pretty though. That's Raisin. The next one I'm going to be using is Burnt Pepper. That's Burnt Pepper. Raisin, Burnt Pepper. And the th third one I'm going to be using is really a glow. It's, it's a blush, but it's a frost, so it's kind of glowy. And this is Margin. And this is what that looks like. And that's margin. The last blush I have is a mineralized blush called Warm Soul. Once again, very glowy. That's what that looks like. So you can, I can use it by itself or on top of those other ones. Maybe. They're also dry. Okay. Those are the blushes. Now let's go on over here to lip products. Now as far as lip products, I don't know what I want to use, but I'm going to, it's going to be by brand. So I'm going to be using my Anastasia. Beverly Hills lip colors. I don't know which one I want, but it will be something out of here because I have not reached for these in so long. But they hold up well. They're not like the ColourPop that separate and look disgusting in the box, in the uh, container. They look, they hold up very well. So it's going to be something out of, out of Anastasia Beverly Hills. And I have three lip pencils that I have not used in a while that I will be using. The first one is ColourPop's BFF3. BFF3. The next one is... Uh, this Jordana Easy Liner in Coco Loco. They look pretty similar. That's Coco Loco, BFF3. And the third one is this NYX Liner in Y2K. And that is what Y2K looks like. So I'll be using these three liners this week. And as far as glosses go, I have two glosses in here in case, no, three. I have three glosses in here. First one is a clear one by Cori Volca. And it's clear. Uh, and I also have two NYX blush, I mean, lip glosses. This one is in Miami Babe. I really pronounced that one, didn't I? That's Miami Babe, a nice pink one. And then the last one is in Salsa. This looks pink too. Looks like it has a little, yeah, this is a, a brighter pink. I should have got a nudie one, but it's okay. So those are the lip glosses and lip liners I'm gonna be using this week. Okay, let's skip over here and just do primers real quick. I have these two primers. I have these in here just to see if I like them. I might be getting rid of these, but this is a Dior Glow Primer and the Dr. Brandt Luminizer Primer. I also have this Glossier Priming Moisturizer. 
I'm also going to be using the NYX Do Me Up primer as well as my Anna Sue gel foundation primer and my Natasha Denona primer that's what that is that's face primers and as far as eye primers I will be using my black up I have a Lorac Laroc and then I have this Kat Von D all right, and my final category is foundation and concealers. I have three foundations I'm going to be using. The first one is the Dior Skin Nude. This one has SPF 15 in it. I also have my Lancome Tint Idol Ultra 24-hour makeup. Also has SPF in it. And the last one is my Clinique Beyond Perfecting Foundation and Concealer. No SPF in that one. Now for concealers, these concealers I have not used in a minute, but I know I like them. The first ones are these ones by Revolution, Makeup Revolution. So I have these three, three different shades here. What are the shades? 12, 12 13, and 16. And I have these by Age Rewind. These Age Rewind by Maybelline. I also love these. And I have these in Golden Caramel and Hazelnut. And the last thing I have in here is not a, a uh, concealer. But I have this matte lip cream a red lip cream from Ulta that I have been using for the coloration around my mouth. It's dark around my mouth and the orange corrector just has not been doing it. So I thought I'd give this a try because I see, oh, I can't remember her name. I see her face. She's beautiful. But she uses a liquid lipstick for her discoloration and it seemed to work for her. So I'm going to be giving this a try. I'll put her name in here, but that's what this is going to be for. So those are my foundations and my concealers and correctors. I forgot one last thing and that is bronzing and contour. I don't know which one I'm going to do, but I have two choices. Oh, what's this? A piece of hair on my ring. Also by Koi Volca. For the bronzer, I have their bronzer in waves. So that's a bronzer. That's their bronzer. Even though it does look a little cool tone, but I'll be using that. And I also have their contour powder in Onyx. And that's what that looks like. Let's watch those bright next to each other. You can definitely tell the difference. Contour. It, it doesn't look cool tone next to this, huh? Contour, contour, bronzer, bronzer, contour. So yeah, that is everything. This is my makeup for the week. And it also gives you a glance of my makeup that I have. So yeah, that's it for this video. Thank you all so much for watching. And I will see you in another one.